What's up, it's your girl Kiana Marie, and I'm back with another video. So today we have a 5x5 pixie cut wig from Love Me Hair. And you know, first things first, I have to unbox all the goodies they sent me. So they sent me this pouch with a few goodies inside of it. It's really cute. I'm actually using it right now. And I got a scarf that says Love Me Hair to tie down my install. I got this little compact mirror. I put it in my purse. It's really cute. And on the back, you know, it has their branding and stuff. So you could just put it in your wallet or wherever you need to. Next, I got this really cute blue edge brush inside of the bag. And then, of course, last but not least for the install, I got a wig cap. So let's get started. They also sent me a pamphlet with a whole bunch of information on how to care for the wig. So I thought that was really cool because, you know, some people don't know how to properly care for them. And we are about to get right into the wig. I unboxed it. The knots were really, really small. The wig was already in a shape and everything, but I like to wash my wigs before I install them. So I washed and flat ironed it a little bit before my install. And it also came with an elastic band in the back for holding it in place. Now we are about to get right into the install. I'm just showing you guys a little bit of what it looks like on the mannequin after I shaped it with my flat iron and went over it a little bit. So this is what the inside looks, just showing you some cap construction. And then I use my Ruby Kisses cream foundation on the lace as per usual. I did not bleach the knots on this wig because I wanted to see what it would look like installed fresh out the box. So that's what I'm doing today. And right now I'm just going to take some powder and set that foundation. This wig is six inches. It is 150% density, although it does look fuller because it's shorter and it is medium brown swiss lace also the lace is five by five for a medium brown swiss lace it does look a lot more natural than most swiss laces do as you can see from me parting and right here i'm just showing you guys how much parting space there is on the wig i can part it all the way back since the five by five closure does give off that frontal effect so one side is longer than the other i just moved my closure a little bit so that the longer side is covering the rest of the hair and it does give off a frontal effect because none of the lace is showing after and i'm just going to cut this in a zigzag motion so you guys can see how natural it starts to look once i cut it absolutely no product has been applied to the lace and look how natural it looks already it looks like it's already practically installed but i'm just going to go in with one product today that is my bedhead high hold hairspray I'm not doing a glue install with this because I really want you guys to see how good this wig is. So I'm just going to spray that down underneath the edges and then tie that down for five minutes. All right, so our five minutes is up. I'm going to go ahead and untie it and look how beautiful that lace is. It looks like I did my hair, like I did my actual hair, like I got a pixie cut or something. And now I'm just brushing that bang back into place because I do want to make sure it's all fixed up before I go in and make the final touches on the wig. After I made a few final touches with my edge brush, that is it. That is the entire install. All right, so let me start off by saying that this wig, now this isn't usually a style that I would go for, but I actually like it on myself. I feel like it complements my face shape so well, especially the cut of how it is. It looks like I got an actual haircut. Like you can't tell me. This is not my scalp. The thing that I like most about this wig is that it's a five by five, so I don't have to glue down the sides. It's very convenient that I don't have to do that. Also, I feel like this wig would look so much better on an older women. I feel like it just complements their face. And I know usually the stuff on my channel is mostly for like younger girls. I feel like this is something for older women. You should definitely try this hairstyle. The lace is absolutely amazing. I didn't bleach it. All I did was wash the wigs because I washed my wigs, you know, as a routine. Washed it and let it air dry. It kept its shape pretty well. The bang, <laughs> I love the bang. Absolutely love it. One of my other favorite things about this wig is the back. Now the way that the cut is, it's layered perfectly to where you wouldn't know it's a wig unless somebody's like, yo, I, I got on a wig. So that's what the cut looks like from the side. Definitely giving, you know, went to the salon, did my hair. The hairs in the nape of your neck don't show. That's what I like about it. And yeah, the fact that it's a five by five, I don't know how they finesse this with a five by five, but definitely recommend this wig if you are an older woman or if you're a younger girl who just wants a shortcut. The hair quality is really, really good. Only thing I did to it was I did go over it on the back with a flat iron. This wig is extremely lightweight. I feel like if I had known about it or if I had actually gotten this during the summer, I would have worn it during the summer because it's not 
a lot of length and it moves around so freely. The cap is breathable, not too tight, leaves space at the back while also covering the nape of your neck. I feel like this wig is perfect for summer or hot climates because it's just a put on and go. Like I didn't have to really do much. All I did was spray it down. You saw how it looked when it was blueless. It looked perfectly fine as well. This wig is 1B and the color did not wash out at all. I feel like it makes me look older though because I am 18, but that's okay. For the, for the grown ladies, I recommend this one. I really do. And I'm just gonna show you guys the amount of parting space it has because this five by five is a full five by five. It goes all the way back. So hold on. Let me just go and show you guys how far it can go back. Look at that. Look at how far it goes. And look at how natural the lace looks. I didn't even have to bleach it. The knots came so small that they were not an issue. If you want to order this gorgeous wig with Love Me Hair, check out the description box below and make sure to use my code for money off of your next order. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.